What's up YouTube? Welcome to the vlog today. Uh, I've got a few things going on today that I thought would be vlog worthy. Um, but first we're going to hit the gym. I got a back and bicep workout going. And so I will be sure to bring y'all for that. But first, I've got to get my pre-workout. So I had a few people asking me what I use for my pre-workout. And so I will tell you guys. Um, so I use Bradley Martin's Origin pre-workout. And I can make a whole video reviewing this sometime, but I do uh, about three, four scoop of this. Um, this is called FBX 2.0, and this is from a company called Max Muscle. And I don't think they're nationwide. I only think they're in a few states. And then I do uh, BPIs, best BCAAs, but the label just fell off on that one. So that's my current pre-workout. I'm gonna load that up in the Umoro right now and uh, hit the gym, so let's get it. All right, YouTube, what is going on? I'm not gonna talk about the workout too much today because it's just a back and bicep workout and I uploaded a back workout last video, so go check that out if you wanna get some actual workout tips, but I'm gonna kinda just let myself go. Um, and one, just one more quick thing is the workout after this is at 2.5 speed, so with all that out of the way, I thought that I'd just kind of leave this as a canvas for me to talk about some of the things going through my mind right now. Um, but what I've been hearing from a lot of people, like friends, you know, colleagues, acquaintances, people on Instagram, is these people come and they have goals, right? This is a common time of year to, uh, you know, be thinking about your goals and, you know, what you want to accomplish in the rest of the year. And so I have a lot of friends that will come up to me and talk to me about projects or, you know, school work that they're working on or fitness things to like, you know, they want to lose 10 pounds or they want to bulk up or, you know, they want to get a six pack for summer or whatever, whatever it is. And a lot of these people come up to me and they're saying, how come I can't get this? I've, I've tried X and Y method before, but I'm not achieving this. And I, I, I guess I'm just an easy person to talk to because I just, I hear this stuff all the time. Um, but it, a lot of people don't see results quickly and they immediately assume that the way that they're doing it isn't right. And you have to keep in mind that for anything to work, you have to put consistency into it. No great physique is built overnight. It takes years and years of hard work to build up a great physique. No business is built overnight. It takes years and years of night in and night out, just working as hard as you can on your craft to make that business successful. And I think people forget that. They stick with something for a month or two and they drop it because they don't see immediate results. And I think it's important that people realize where their priorities are and they have to evaluate what they're going for in life. Everything that you receive will be a direct correlation of what you put into it. Nothing is going to come to you because you didn't work for it. So people come up to me and ask me, like I said, how can I achieve this and that? I've tried this and that before. And I say, how long have you tried that for? And they said, not very long. And I said, that's your problem. You have to be consistent. And I just, I guess I've been seeing that a lot lately. And so my advice to you is be in something for the long haul. Don't just make something a short term Goal, make it part of your lifestyle to achieve those large parts of your life that you want to accomplish. You know, maybe you want to start a business, maybe you want to compete in a show or anything like that. You know, make it part of your day to day so it's something that you enjoy doing. Because if it's something that you hate, you're never going to be able to do it for a long time. So, I don't know, that's kind of what's been on my mind lately. So, get out and do it. Stop making excuses and stay consistent with what you're doing and I promise you that you'll see results. So that's the end of this little rant, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, enjoy the rest of the video, and I'll catch you in the next commentary. Peace. I just, just finished the workout, guys. It was quick, but it was good, and I'm just stopping by my apartment's mail center because uh, I got a little, uh, a little goodies coming in the mail. So once I get back to my apartment, I'll show you what's in there. All right, so the packages that I got were my Alphalete shipments from the sale that they had last week and I'm so bitter I'm so bitter because they sold out in like like under 10 minutes I think 
and I had probably 20 things in my cart and I was checking out and apparently Shopify made an update where your items aren't like secured it used to be like you could hold them for five minutes but um, they were sold in real time so I had like 20 items and it was gonna be such a good deal but I ended up only getting like five things because um, they all sold out while I was checking out so I was like freaking out and I had to order two shipments because I was afraid that they were gonna sell out while I was still ordering but anyway here's what I got um, let's unbox them real quick wait no that's not right that's better <laughs> so I got the blue short sleeve uh, Evo shirt I have the long sleeve but I got in short sleeve because I liked it and that was the only one they had left in stock and then I got the white lifestyle fishtail uh, I have the red one and I really liked it so I picked up that one got the v-neck black lifestyle real simple but sweet and then I got the gray joggers because I absolutely love my other pair so that was my haul from the launch or the sale I mean uh, Again, I'm pretty disappointed that I wasn't able to get it. Um, I feel like Alphalete should have like a loyalty program or something because I've literally been with them since the first launch and uh, I feel like the loyal customers should get a little like priority or something because the selling out was ridiculous. Because um, I feel like there's a ton of people that just bought it because they, there was a sale happening. They weren't even Alphalete fans. so. I don't know, I just felt like it was kind of unfair and I got kind of gypped. But um, anyway, uh, it is about four o'clock right now. Um, I am planning on heading up to my grandparents' house, actually. They live about an hour south of where I go to school. And so I'm gonna drive down there tonight, spend the night at their house, relax a little bit, eat some good food, because no matter how good you are at cooking, it's always better at your mom or grandma's house. Like, I, I don't know what it is, you could be, Gordon Ramsay and your mom's still gonna be better at you than cooking or grandma. Anyway, <laughs> so I'm gonna go there. Um, I'm gonna vlog the drive, so I will see you guys in the next clip. Alrighty, heading out on the road. I don't know about you guys, but I absolutely love driving. Like just being able to like zone out for an hour, listen to music, and just you know deep think. A little bit, I don't know, I just think it's really relaxing. So, um, I don't know. Gonna drive, takes about an hour to get there. So, I will see y'all there. Might even introduce you to my grandparents. Um, they're quite uh, old fashioned, so they might not really understand YouTube, but um, I don't know, might be fun. I'll see you guys later. Amy, do you wanna be introduced to my YouTube channel? Yeah, do I have to stop cooking? No, it's okay. So I just made it to my grandparents' house. I'm I'm like recording my day's little vlog. And we're having tacos. We are. She's teaching me how to make beef, but this is my uh, grandma. I call Hello. her Mimi. <laughs> why? Do you know why I call it? What? Where'd that name come from? Uh, I think that's how Cassidy. Oh, my other cousin. That's okay. He named me. Gotcha. <laughs> So, but she's just teaching me how to make her awesome taco beef. So let's see what we're making over yeah, here, Mimi. Let's, let's, uh. So we got all, we're having taco night tonight. Salsa, cheese, onions, lettuce, and whoever wants sour cream. It sounds delicious. And then she has a, like I was saying, she has this awesome beef, any, all the tacos all the time. And it's like one of my favorite sources of protein ever but um so what would you say you put in it you put that seasoning that we saw uh -huh. over there saute that uh what is it beef the hamburger okay oh, chili con carne and that's chili it. con carne and then get corn tortillas corn Olive tortillas oil. well you heard it here folks mimi's <laughs> award-winning mm -hmm. tacos so uh, we're about to chow down on uh, some tacos, so I'm gonna enjoy that. So catch you guys later. We are uh, we're Man. having we're having some ice cream and strawberries, and I was telling Mimi about my 
LA Fit Expo experience. <laughs> and I was just showing her the pictures of uh, it's cool. of uh, Bradley Martin and stuff like that. But yep. um, so yeah, that's it. We're just chilling right now, eating some eating some strawberries and ice cream. You know, just enjoying ourselves a little bit. All right, so it is obviously the next day. I am just doing some homework and some client work right now, and just doing some workout plans and stuff like that. But it's a pretty chill day. Um, I'm just kind of hanging out, spending time with my grandparents, and it's kind of nice to be able to come back here and just chill. Uh, it's kind of hectic at school, and you know, a lot of stuff is going on. So it's good to come back here, visit them once in a while, relax. And so, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you have any comments below. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.